All right. Hello, YouTube. All right or all left? Both. Yeah, that's... You gotta pick one direction. Yeah, get it. One direction. <laughs> uh, anyway, uh, we are back with some more uh, Evil Within 2. I have my good friend Zachary here with me. He is watching through the... Um, share play thing because he's not actually physically here so say hello Zachary uh, morning sounds good oh can you see everything fine yeah I can see everything fine who are you playing as who's this guy this guy is named uh, Sebastian Castellanos he is a detective or an ex-cop he is an ex-cop because uh, he's kind of a drinker and he kind of went crazy after the whole events of the first game, which I will definitely explain to you. Oh yeah, well he seems like an alcoholic to me, but well I shouldn't assume that. That's me. Go again into the looking glass. <coughs> yeah. Here we go. That right into the mirror. Because he wanted to. Well. I mean, did, why didn't you just turn off the light and then, like... Actually, there, well, actually, what we are in... We're in a machine right now that takes us in the into the minds. It takes us in our minds. It's basic. It, it's basically like oh, no. the Matrix and Inception put together. Lily, what's wrong? Aww. Uh, My doll's head is broke. Just, like, off it's okay. Yeah. Mom can fix it. I mean, it's it fine. Me. It's it's way better than the last anything. game. The hair still looks a little strange. Huh. Your doll's not gonna make it. Sorry, honey, you broke its neck. It can't be fixed. <laughs> oh, my hand. It's so nice. Sebastian? What's wrong? Are you it's okay, Mira. I've got a wonderful family, an amazingly and a smart, very sweaty and head. Wife. Why wouldn't I be all right? Come here, Myra. Uh, uh, uh. You've been working too hard. It's making you delirious. Are you sure you're not coming down with something? Yeah, he's like. Oh shit. He is hallucinating a beetle. Yes. The mirrors is basically his way of, I guess, teleporting from his hub world, which is his office, to the quote unquote main world. Imagine if he was able to transport him right to place? the Intergalactic Federation and just kick the crap out of everybody. Oh wait, Rick already did that. Yes. Ooh. That's what pretty. The... Pretty frightening. <laughs> pretty dang. I had to make my TV louder. I can't hear much. That's fine. It is so nice. Like, I, I, I love what they did with the graphics in this. Uh, this is boring to me so far. I want to see more. Oh, you'll be seeing more, all right. I'll tell you, it's kind of the the play style kind of reminds me of a Last of Us two kind of approach. Huh? Or not the Last of Us two, just Last of Us in general, because. No, I get you. I can already picture myself playing as fucking Ellie and uh and um. Joel. And what the hell is his name? Joel. Joel. His name is Joel. That was it, Joel. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That was his name. Well, what's this? Dude, that game was... I only played that game once throughout the story. I couldn't play it again. I got... Like, that game gave me, like, too many emotions. <laughs> it is a very emotional game. It also was really hard, and I can't play it for shit. I love that game. It is so good. I love it, too. I, I can see why a lot of people love it, but there's just some... That, that type of game is like a one... Like, I'll play it once, and then just... I'll call them. I'll call it a century. You know. I'll... Ooh, look at all these pretty paintings. <sighs> what the hell? Whoa. That 
Woods. One of the search team. They just get like Baker. Oh shoot. Huh. He's got his brain blown out. Yeah, it's all bloody and ugh. Can you touch it? Don't know what it is. Dude, that's blood. Whoa. Whoa. This is Dude, is this like an acid trip? Like, I don't know. The team leader. Just one oh, Jesus, then this is a team leader guy. We were supposed to find them. Basically, a bunch of uh, agents went into this machine because pretty much the brain of the machine, which is a little girl, started acting different. And they sent this team in to get her out, but something happened. Now they're all trapped in here, and that's why I'm here to help them get out. But unfortunately, we have no idea what happened. So, so the concept of the story is to figure out what happened to the team. Not the team leader, but like, what happened with the machine and who affected the machine? Pretty much. And in order by doing that, you'll be able to figure out how the team leader got killed and just all this other stuff? Sadistic. Whoever did this it's must have enjoyed it. My head <laughs> yeah, this game is very confusing. At least the first game was pretty confusing when it came to the story. It, it took a while to understand it. I'm I'm not gonna comment on anything at all about that. Will you comment on this? Hmm? Nope. Nope. I heard it. I'm just gonna ignore it. I really hope the let's play hears it. <laughs> <laughs> Man, this is creepy. It is 10.48. Can I get out of here? Nope. That's locked. Ladies and gentlemen, I tell this man to do his push-ups every day, and he never does. <laughs> that is actually not true at all. Hello? Hello? What was that? Shit. Fucking crank caller. Who was that? Probably left some shit on my doorstep. Jerk. Hmm. Interministing. Anything over here? No? Can't, can't do anything about the door? Wait, what? Oh, no. That was just the shininess of this. Nope. That's locked. Huh. We in the red light district. Crouch. It, it says crouch pad. Why didn't you huh. crouch? this say congratulations truth seeker thank you for taking our spiritual acuity acuity uh, acuity test we're pleased to welcome you to the next level of knowledge please report to the nearest uh, uh, mu center or mu center uh, i'm gonna say mu center with this letter to ascend from probationary applicant to the position of mu disciple this letter guarantees you an an exalated exe or excel yeah pos position at the next cleansing ceremony handwritten on the back of the envelope lies all lies ooh lies all lies lies all lies that's what they say all lies no oh, curiosity killed the cat wonk 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 grand oh yeah this is very grand 
What's up? I wonder if there's any pot in that box. <laughs> Who knows? Oh shit! Oh. Hey! Uh, damn it! Uh, damn it! What's going on here? Yeah, uh, we're in a very scary place. The window open. Actually, funny enough, in my uh, part one, um, in a flashback, he kind of broke a window open, so that's very interesting why he didn't do that again. This is a very lone chair. Alright, Seb, what are we gonna do here? What are we gonna do about this? Oh. I think this is the last thing that I saw before I caught up. This is very Twin Peaks. Anybody who watches the show Twin Peaks will know exactly what I'm talking about. This is this is literally Twin Peaks. Yeah, this is one of the last things that I saw before I caught up, I think. Oh shit. Oh, it's a guy. Oh. Wow. How did you do that? What was, what that? was that? Shit. Entering and exiting cover. Uh, hold R1. Uh, this is L1. R1. To enter cover when the cover icon is displayed, blah blah blah. Move alongside. Oh boy. Oh Jesus. Hmm. <sighs> yeah, please walk away. We don't need you here. Why didn't he just turn? What a bye. Who the hell was that? What a weirdo. This guy's suit is so outdated. This guy's just in a box. Yeah. Very odd. Just like the search team. Poor guy. Ugh. He's so upset. Wow, that's look at that cut. Dude, he he flashed him, dude. Like. Like, 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 like slush, like, oof. That's so interesting. I'd probably pass out if I saw it in real life. But in a video game, it's different. I gotta find a way out of here. Yeah, no shit. Oh, these paintings are so creepy. Oh, look at those eyes. Look at those lips. Damn. Oh, uh... Um, I wonder what's in there. Maybe there's pretty. candy? Oh, we should get a stick and hit like a piano. Ooh, hi. Hey, hey, don't. Oh, Jesus. Well, we can't get over there. Oh, you see that? There's a little leg sticking out. Come here. Come on. Come here, leggy. Come here, leggy. Yeah, you know what? No thanks. I'm gonna go back up the stairs. This is just no thanks. Ah, uh, I felt better. Yeah, right? I'm just hanging out. What the fuck is that? Come on. Uh, oh Jesus. Hey, I'm over here, guy! How can he just appear out of fucking nowhere? Well, we're in a place where anything can happen. Like again, like we're in like a mind kind of thing. Where powers and weird crazy shit exists. And I'm, I'm going to guess that this is one of the guys that's involved with what's happening. Yeah, but how can you just transport like that? Who knows? For all we know, he could just be like some, some guy that was given this ability. For all we know, this could just be like 
some crazy weird shit. Why is the arrow swinging down there? Hello? Alright then. Oh. What in the hell Christ. is that? Actually, that doesn't look like Jesus Christ, but, uh, you're okay, buddy. Oh, I'm so yonified. Oh, okay then. I guess it was just showing that. Anything over here? Nope. Get to the elevator. Clickety click. Oh boy. Uh, I'm very creeped out. Although I do, I, I, I love creepy games, but at the same time, my anxiety is just through the roof. Uh, nice burp. My dick is through the roof. Oh, I'm sure it is, buddy. I am so sure it is. Crouch. Where? Ah, over here. Alright, let's see. Um... Okay. Uh... You know what? I'm going to end this episode right here. I know it's ending it short, uh, around 18 minutes, but I'm going to end it right here, and I'm going to play this again at probably 2 p.m., where it's nice and bright. So uh, thank you guys for enjoying this Let's Play video. Zachary, say bye. Hey, Pat. Look at them. One's waving at you. <laughs> yeah.